Wait a minute, is this a pineapple ham sandwich? This is just like a pineapple ham pizza. I'll get to it, let's just finish the awesome song. I mean, absolutely 10 out of 10. That sandwich burnt my eye sockets. But if it was a Ben rating, I'd have to give that sandwich Mm, minus 100 cockroaches. I would never eat that. I would bin it. It would get in the bin. Have you guys ever been to the bad side of food TikTok where they just make the most bizarre videos and show it off as if it's like some artsy creation? When the reality of it is, is it just burns your eyes out, melts your brain because you can't understand how people make such disgusting noises while they eat or just the fact they eat the most bizarre stuff going. So that's what we're gonna be looking at today, guys. I hope you enjoy it. I mean, this first one here should probably give you a good, strong indication as to what this video is about. Okay, where, where does anyone even get a wad of butter that big <laughs> and then just starts eating it like an absolute psycho what bruh I, I hope your heart has insurance jesus christ it is 10 o'clock in the morning and this has already ruined my day that, that is disgusting okay so i'm gonna do like a live commentary of what is going on now the dude is still speed running a cardiac arrest and so far, it looks like he's going to actually achieve it. Now he's just got like a chicken wing. Awesome. I think everyone likes a chicken wing. And he's just eaten the fucking bone. Like what? What he even is this dude? <laughs> this dude just ate the whole chicken. Literally. Okay, this guy actually has more on his TikTok of him just eating food. Let's see what he's got. Oh my God. Come on, dude. What? <laughs> Who even eats that like that? <laughs> like he's still... He's still... <laughs> what <are you> <laughs> Come on, man, put it down. Well, how long is this? Oh my god, what have I just seen? I mean, the rest of the video is actually pretty normal. He eats this corn, he has a bit of watermelon, and then he obviously just, you know, he just eats the skin of the watermelon, as you do. I have been seeing so many of these recently and I don't really know how they know that I like watching food videos because I know you guys might think I have a crazy life outside of YouTube but the reality of it is I am actually watching videos on YouTube like late night chorizo grilled cheese. This video was four years ago and it has 12 million views. And I am probably like 10 of them. I'm not even going to lie. It's a pretty great video if you guys want to check it out. It's very simple. It's just a dude making a grilled chorizo sandwich. But with all that being said, let's just eat some tables, burn our eyes out, and let's just enjoy some spaghetti. Sound good? Let's go. All right. So <clears throat> I also love hot sauce on chicken, period. On fried chicken, put it that way. Mm -hmm. Yeah, do you know what? I'm not even going to complain. Fried chicken with a bit of hot sauce sounds nice. But the, the real issue is why do you have an entire Barbie house just attached to your nails? Like, I know what I'm about to say now is completely irrelevant. But, like, how do you do, like, basic anything? How do you, like, open a door with those absolute just Barbie doll talent? Obviously, after that fried chicken and hot sauce, you're going to have to take a colossal dump. You know how difficult it is to wipe your ass with those things? I just realized I said, do you know how difficult it is to wipe your ass with nails like this? I want to make this very clear because I know you guys will go crazy and say that I have nails like this. I do not have nails like this. I just know that these nails suck for doing such an activity. And I rest my case. Do I need to say any more? But I mean, seriously, who watches these videos of food ASMR and likes the sound of these nails just scratching up against the box? So this video here is apparently people making mac and cheese. I'm not personally a fan of mac and cheese. In fact, I don't really like it. So anyone who enjoys mac and cheese, can you please tell me if this looks good?
Okay, I don't think I need anyone to say anything. That looks just absolutely horrendous. That just looks like some mac and cheese soup. It honestly looks like someone just got a mop bucket, rinsed the mop out in it, and just poured it over the mac and cheese. I can just imagine the sound just being so slimy and just, oh, it'd just be horrible. But it's like this cheesy soup, like a really thin, cheesy soup. Oh yeah, I, I totally need some honey right now. Let me just go get my whole beehive and bring it in here for some ASMR. I, I know people have these type of things, like the whole beehive thing, but who wants to hear ASMR of you just peeling the honey away? Like, who is on social media going like, oh, I would just love to hear the sound of honey being peeled away from the hive. I, I would not be surprised if people are searching for like cows being milked ASMR, where it's just some guy just milking a cow and you just hear all the, the milk. <laughs> That's so stupid. This next video here, honestly, I don't know if it's good. I, I do know it. it. It's terrible. I don't know if anyone could honestly try what is in this next video and think this looks good. They're making some kind of Mexican food here. Apparently, it's like a nacho dish. It's apparently called gringo style nachos. So enjoy. And we're just going to completely get it all on the counter. Spread it around as much as you can. I like to uh, pour a lot of ground beef. Just right, right, right there. Okay, black beans all in here. I mean, who wouldn't want to try nachos off your dirty kitchen tabletop? My God. Taco seasoning, this is really, really important. Because it's not, you don't get enough spice without this. Take this all over. So, even more cheese just all over the top of this. Ice cream salad, just gonna blend it up. All the way in here. Wow. Yeah, you've got, you've got to really love that really enthusiastic wow right there, as if that looks good in any way. That is one big pile of shit. In here. Wow. That's good. That's good. So now, the most important part, tortilla chips. You just want to kind of lay them all out in here. As many as you can get. And then you're going to get your hands in here and just blend them in. Just like that. Yeah. Go. Okay. I think we all know what that looks like. I do not need to say it. It just looks like a steaming pile of baby spaghetti. Pop that out of the top. That beautiful. And you're gonna take your ice cream scooper. What are you gonna do with an ice cream scooper? I'm gonna serve you this colossal pile of absolute shit. If I ever went round to anyone's house and they just whipped this up on the table counter, I would just not eat it. The cheese itself look like it would just clog your arteries and you'd die. I mean, if this is a joke, bravo, enjoy cleaning up the mess. But if this is a legitimate food hack, this is absolutely awful. I would never eat that. Just like that. Yeah, it looks delicious. Uh, save some for the dog, which I am sure he will learn to use the toilet just to push out whatever comes out of him after eating that. But that is it for today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like this video, be sure to like and subscribe as it really helps me out. I'm trying to find like just different type of videos you guys might enjoy. I'm a bit, bit running out of ideas at the moment. But with that being said, I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you guys next time.